Hello YouTube, I am Galadite74, and this is my week 1 battle of the PBA. I will keep this intro team builder brief as you guys are here for the battle, but we are fighting Ellie, coach of the Shanghai Dragons. Make sure to check out her channel, link in the description below. She is currently participating in the PPL and popping off. Her video quality is really good, and we are both a part of the editing team for that league, so we talk to each other quite a bit. For this game and for the season, rather than talk about the sets, I will show you the sets and talk about the game plan, because that's more important. For this week, the biggest threat to my team is Chien Pao and Rotom Wash, Rotom mainly allowing Chien Pao to come in. Skeledurge being able to terrestrialize also proves to be a threat to my team. The goal is to out offense Ellie and not allow her to ever bring in the Chien Pao for free. Another big goal of mine throughout this game is to put everything in range of an Iron Valiant endgame, thanks to booster energy. The way I plan to combat Rotom's ability to pivot on my team is by terrestrializing my breaker, Volcanion, into a ground type so it completely shuts down that Pokemon. Claude Sire is almost only here to toxic the Skeledurge, because otherwise that Pokemon can outlive my offense if my team is whittled down. I foresee this game potentially being a sack race, so hopefully I'll be able to get an early Mon advantage and win with Iron Valiant when all is said and done. Thank you to CV Marcus and JV for the mocks, and let's get into this battle. Uh, in terms of lead, it was probably Volcanion. Uh, Cleaver's really awkward in this game, but because there's a Coalfish, it makes me a little bit better. I can kind of just switch into that. Um, Volcanion's a really free lead, because if... Like, I can just Steam Eruption. If Rotom's the lead, I can Terra and I wall it. If Dragonite leads, I have Quarternite that always just deals with it. It's not really an issue. And uh, same with Iron Truth, I get Terra and just Steam Eruption and kill it and tank the Earthquake. So we'll stick with that. Good luck, have fun to Ellie. I'm looking very forward to this game. Uh, but I am hella nervous. I mean, that's kind of typically how it is, right? And if Chain Pal leads too, I always tank one hit from that guy. So not worried about the Chain Pal off rip. But, um, I have done mocks for this. I, you guys know I do not like doing mocks at all, but this is like the first time I did mo multiple mocks for a uh, league. So yeah, it is the Rotom lead. I kind of figured. Uh, it sucks that I'm going to lose my only Ice Resist turn one, but, um, I think being able to wall this is so important. So I'm just going to Terrastalize and Steam Eruption. I just had to be weary of who I sacked throughout this game. Um... I think rocks are important, but I don't think Cleavor is that important, so that might be like the first sack. But again, they cannot hard switch into anything. Well, I guess Dragonite with multi-scale, right? But breaking that thing's multi-scale, getting a potential burn, uh, would be massive. Uh, Champau can actually, again, cannot hard switch into this guy. Nothing else really wants to do either. So, this is, this should be a 3 co if it's Bidef. They just switched out. That's definitely the Dragonite. All right, we'll break this thing's uh, scale. Uh, kind of again now it kind of sucks that I terrorized, but um, I I don't want to just take the Volt Switch, you know. I was also almost Terra Fairy in this game, but Dragonite. So this is gonna do like twenty percent with the multi scale up. So we do hit. That's it. Yeah, it looks about right. Don't get a burn. I do have a switch into this, into Corv, and I will go into it every single time. I think that's what I want to do. I mean, like, they could go Rotom, right? Like, I wouldn't care about that, though. Or Dirge, either, because I still have the uh, Cloud Sire. I think best case scenario in this game is, um... What's it called? I can catch the Enchant out with one of my bait sets, like the Cloud Sire, or... You know, something else. Just DDs. Okay. Oh, that actually is a little scary. Low key. Uh, I think I just U turn. Iron Head doesn't really do much to this. They fire punch. It's gonna do a bit. Wow, that did a lot more than I thought it was gonna do. Uh, that's Rocky Helmet Chip. Okay, that did a little... That just did more than I thought it was going to do. It's fine. It's alive, though, because I can switch into that tread still. Um, this thing's plus one, plus one. I do have a Scarf Gren here, and I also have the Boost Energy guy. Um, 
I don't think an E speed at plus one kills me. It shouldn't. No. Um, Grand Health's kind of nice, but not crazy important. It's this with a Claude, and I think the Gren's the better play here. I'm telling them that, like, I'm Scarf. I almost- man, I should've went Sash Cleavor. I almost did that. Whatever. Uh, Yachi shouldn't- man, I think Ice Beam just cleaves through this guy. Um, I don't want to mess around with this threat, so I'm just gonna Ice Beam. Uh, Rotom's, like, the freest switch in ever. Even, hell, Champ House, like, free, but that's fine. Balls. Wait, who's this? Oh, it's the Quillfish. Oh, that's fine. That's actually quite fine. That was a decent chunk. And I get a free... Mm, sorry about that. That's really rough. Uh, I could say in and just hit it again, but I want to get... I need to get my rocks up, I think. Um, they're crazy important in this game. Or I could just go and roost, but... I think this is still a fine play. I don't know what other play I would have made here, so I think this is good. Yeah, I'm sorry about that freeze, Ellie. That actually really sucks, and they stay frozen, yeah. Um, I get my rocks here, or I could just dance. You don't go hard, Chien Cow. That's crazy. I have the Bibiri for the treads. I don't think Rotom's fast. I feel like just rocks are fine, right? I think I just, I think I dance. I could just forego rocks. You don't go hard, champ, pal. It's just Rotom that scares me. Uh, let me let me, let me stone axe. Let me just stone axe. Yeah, okay, they switch out. That makes me feel a little better about the play. If they go Rotom, I'll feel really good about this. No, they go to this guy. Yeah, this is why I wanted to dance. But getting rocks up is still kind of nice. I, well, I'm not gonna get rocks up if I miss. Yeah, it's you know it's all fair in the game, I guess. Um, it's a little annoying, but I could CC this, but it doesn't kill. I don't know if I like this play yet. I mean, this is my chance to get Cord back in, right? So I think this is fine. I'm gonna stay in, and I'm gonna, I, I have this for a reason. I'm just gonna CC this. I would have loved Rocks up as well. They do Iron Head, and they do have the move. Okay. Um. I wasn't sure if they were going to have Iron Head in this game, but they do. Uh, go, go for CC. This will do like 70-ish percent. Oh, they're a Chopple! Okay, that I wasn't expecting. Alright, alright, that's good to know. And I'm actually really glad I got rid of that. Uh, this guy can still come in on, on the, uh, what's its face? So I'm going to save this and go into Corv. Yeah. Uh, worst, worst scenario here is Volt Switch. But, I should be able to just tank any hit. Okay, Iron Head, that's fine. That was a bit of damage, jeez. Uh, I'm pretty sure Volt Switch just kills me at this range, so that kind of sucks. But I can get momentum that way, so I'm going to Roost just in case that they don't kill me with Volt Switch here. They just withdraw, okay, that's fine. This is going to be the uh, the dirge. Okay, that's this is this is fine. This is fine. Keeping core rounds really nice. That being said, this mont is a threat. I don't. I put a little bit of speed into this. I really don't think the guys are gonna have speed, but I don't. There's no reason for me to risk it, right? I have a claw tire. This is my switch in. I could also go hard cleavor, which I don't think is half a half bad play. But Claude's meant for this guy, so I will just go into Claude. I think the scariest thing would be Will O Wisp and Sub. Like, one or the other is fine, but if it's both, then that becomes a threat. It's Torch Song, that's fine. I'm unaware, so I don't really care about this. That does so much, though, that is offensive. I have Toxic for this guy. Um, you don't go Hard Treads here, that'd be kind of weird, I think. I think I just Toxic. They're gonna Terra. Yeah, that's fine. Um, yeah, that's, that should be fine. 
It's Terra Water, yep. I, of course, that was, that is what was brought in, uh, prep. You know, Mox or whatever. Uh, will o -Wisp. okay, that's, okay, I should land, I hit this Toxic, so it's, this thing's no longer a threat. Oh, okay, good, good, good. Unless they have, like, you know, Rest or something, or they're, like, Lum, but... Getting a poison on this is super, super nice. Like, so nice for me. Okay, good, good, good. So it's Willow, it's Torch Song, Offensive Torch Song. I think I just recover now. I can just recover, yeah. They Terror Blast. Um, this is gonna hurt. This might kill. Uh, it's not plus one because I'm unaware, but it is super effective. Okay, I live. Sick. Uh, it does, still does a lot of damage. So there's Torch Song, Will O Wisp, probably Slack Off, and Terror Blast. I think I just go into the uh, Volcanion, right? I think I just go Volcanion. No, 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 I'm ground. I'm gr Wait, I'm Water Absorb. Yeah, yeah. Um, Because I can just Earth Power this. I mean, what do I need this for, though, right? I don't really need this. Uh, let me do the calc real quick on a Claw Sire. On a Terra Blast. Water. Your, like, max special attack. It does more than half. Um, I live a Torch Song. Go on, Volcanion. They Torch Song, good play. Uh, it's gonna hurt. Again, I do li I should live the hit, though, is the thing. They do Torch Song. Okay, that sucks. But again, I live. This thing is not spit out. Uh, Earth Power would kill this. Uh, I guess Dragon I could come out, right? Dragonite comes out. Oh no, I'm not. No, that's actually fine still. Yeah, I'm Earth Power. Uh, I think. I don't know if I. Yeah, I do kill this. What I'm talking about. I, I should kill it. Uh, Rotom would be annoying, but, like, not the end of the world still. Could just sack the Quillfish here. Man, it's Torch Song the Cloth Sire. Really? I could have just spammed Recover. I mean, I mean, it's fine. Um, I think if they go Rotom, I just sack Cloud Sire, because this thing Toxic, it's not a threat. Like it's always be, it's always easy to revenge kill. They actually switch out. They go Dragonite, good play. Rotom, semi still a good play, but not as scary. Mr. Dingle, that's the Rotom, right? Yeah. Okay. Got me there. Uh, I think I just sacked the Claude. I mean, yeah. Draw, okay. Balls. Oh, this guy. Okay. I had thought about Earth Firing again, but it didn't really feel worth it. This gives me a chance to recover again, actually. Yeah, actually, I think I just recover. And then switch out after. I'm going Cleaver next turn. Again, this free sucks, so I, I, I'm sorry, Ellie. Alright, now I switch. I don't want to be playing passive versus this guy if it's frozen. I could just go this. I could just go Volcanion. But getting my rocks up could be nice. Cause I don't get my rocks up on anything else, so. I'd rather just get it up in front of this thing. I mean if they unfreeze and like liquidate, man, another frozen turn. Brutal. Again, like, forcing treads in is fine, is good for me. Because my core is healthy again. Like, they can't kill me. 
And it's already like lowish health anyway, so. Like all good things for me there. There's Rift Draw. Pro again, probably out into the treads. I'll go into Rotom this time. That's fine. I get rocks up. Cool, cool, cool. Oh my gosh. That did so much damage. What? Okay, this thing's offensive. Because that should... There is no world that should have ever uh, did that much. Uh... Yeah, it could be like some HP, but definitely not defensive. Um, I do have a lot of speed, but this thing could be a lot of speed because of that. I should go Volcano, that's my switching. Go into this. Uh, I switched out first, by the way. Let's keep that in mind. They pump, and I get my health back. Let's go. That's so good for me. I just Steam Eruption now. Um, yeah, I just Steam Eruption. That's, that is so good. I don't care if Dragonite comes out at this point. Um, obviously, like, I didn't talk Quillfish, but who really cares, right? Uh, Skeletal Dirge is not a switch in because it's not fully spit F, and it's already taken some chip. I think if Dragonite comes out, I, I just stay in next time. So I can't get the, so I can't get the multi-scale. Switches out. Goes into balls. That's the uh, the cool fish, right? Yeah. Uh, this should kill. If not, the next one will. Intimidate does not matter. A steam eruption. I do miss. That's a little annoying, but not really the end of the world. I'm just gonna click it again. Like this is a sack. Let's be real. Okay, I killed. All right. Yeah, it's dead. Sick. That's the uh, that's his that's uh, Ellie's best Iron Val late game answer gone. In fact, Iron Val late game is starting to look really good. Like, almost just wins the game at this point good. It honestly might win the game at this point. The Iron Val. Actually, I think Val does win. What, Scarf Chan Pao? Would maybe stop me? Yeah, I think I just win with the Iron Val. Um, do I have a move for Dirge? I don't actually have a move for Dirge, so I think I need that a little bit lower. Okay, this th this guy comes out. Who am I sacking? Uh, I kind of want to keep this. This seems really good in this game. I could go just Corv. Corv's still decent in this game, though. I go Cleavor. I think that's the play. I don't need Cleavor at this point. Yeah, that's the play. Uh, Sword Zanth could be sh could be scary. So go into this. It's trash. Okay, so this this dies. I think I just go Gren and U-turn, and if they stay in, I just sack something else, right? It's like it's just how much do I value the uh, the booster on the guy? Who do I sack if I U-turn and they stay in? Probably Claude, right? I think just Claude. Yeah, I'm gonna go into this guy in U turn. And if I get the damage off, they can't switch back in on rocks. I'm pretty sure that's how that works. I can find out if this thing's Scarf too. They outspeed me here. I, I just don't remember how much health Dirge was at, and Dirge can kind of live one hit from Val, so I don't want to pop my booster if the Dirge is always just there still. But, like, at this point, any chip on Dirge wins me the game, I think. Yeah, a any chip on Dirge should uh, just seal it for me. So, I will, uh, I'll just play for that. They switch out. Yeah, that that's brilliant for me. If they go Dirge now, it just makes my life easy. Now they go into Dragonite. That's fine. Oh, they are not even boots. Okay, sick. Oh, now I wish I had Cleaver alive, but it's fine. Um, I should go Corv, I think. I could go Volcanion. Volcanion's, uh, doesn't really matter. Um, I think I just go Dirge. I mean, Corv. Yeah, I go Corv here. And I U-turn. 
Like, if they roost, I go back on the Granite Ice Beam. Damage on, like, them damaging me does not mean anything. Because Treads is so low at this point. We'll see what Ellie wants to do here. They just Fire Punch, yeah, that's fine. And I actually, oh, I get a U-turn kill, I think. Yeah, it does kill, okay. Uh, so they actually get momentum off of this, which is fine. Um, I just go Gren again. I OP Scarf Rotom. I get my chip on Dirge if that comes out now. Um, Treads dies. Chin Palace not. Yeah, okay, there, yeah, here's the chip I need. Yeah, this thing would've lived to hit. <laughs> it's Boots, okay. Um, yeah, I U-turn here. And go back out in the Clod. Or you could just go Volk. Torch Song does under half, or right, 42 to 50 to my um, Volcanion with Terra. If I'm above that, I think I just go into it hard. Oh, that's a lot of damage, jeez. I am above it. Um, I feel like Claude doesn't really give me a winning play. Yeah. I love this Torch Song. Oh, there's Slack Off. Okay. Um, Wire Power. I could Sludge Bomb, too. I could Sludge Bomb. Doesn't... Oh, wait. It's not Spit F. Um, oh, my God. That's so much still. Yeah, I just Sludge Bomb, actually, this time. I don't care if, like, Treads can come in and get the rocks off the field. I don't really need the rocks at this point. If they go Treads now, it's a good play. Because I don't get any chip on this, and they get a free switch in. That kind of sucks for me, but... Uh, Sludge Bomb does half to this. Uh, that's just how it is, right? Torchon doesn't kill me. They switch out. Probably go in the Rotom. Yes. Okay, good. Uh, this dies. Whew. Still scared. Uh, Treads comes out for free and get the spin. I'm like, that's just gonna be how it is, right? I switch out here. Go into Corv. I could just go hard Gren. Is that a throwing play? I really feel like it's not. Maybe it is. Maybe I am throwing at that. I live any. I live offensive earthquake. Nah, I just go Corv. It's it's fine. Uh, they have Iron Head. They have Earthquake. That's, they have that Earthquake, right? They have Spin. They don't have like all the setup moves they could have, you know. They do spin, so yeah, I could have I could have went uh, the guy there. They take my helmet chip. I just roost here. Yeah. So they switch out. This thing might be choice scarfed for all I know. They go into the dirge. Again, this thing's poison, so it can't actually like really beat me at all. I'm a, I put my Corp at a range where only Banded uh, Chain Pal can kill me from this range, so I switch out. Uh, again, I really want to make just the offensive play and go into uh, Volcanion, but that seems kind of dumb considering I can always just Earth Power on a sweet free switch. And I can spam Earthquake at this point with this guy. Yeah, that seems silly. Because next time Volcanion comes in, I get a kill. Like, guaranteed. So. That's just a silly play for me if I do that. So, let's just play the, the passive route. Like, if he crits me with Torch Song. Like, that's, like, extremely dumb. Cool. And now I just spam Recover. Get some Toxic turns up. Because, again, I, I, I can get this thing in range of Iron Battle 2. That also wins me the game. 
You know, there's just so many avenues at this point. Terra Blast, I live this. It does a lot of damage to me, but... It, like, all I need is the chip. Oh, well, I think that crit, so... No, I just killed, what? Okay. Jesus Christ. But this is what I mean, I just go into Volcanion and I get a kill. With Earth Power. Whew. Uh, I think Treads is gonna be the sack here. I don't know, this is a really tough spot for Ellie to be in. I hope my commentary hasn't been too bad. Sorry, I've been kind of a little boring with my commentary, but like I've just been trying to focus and win this game here. It's my first Wi-Fi game of the gen, you know, I, I want to win this game. Um, this should die. Like, there's there should be no world where this lives. Yeah, that dies. Alright, yeah. Um, Val wins. Because I just stay in at this point, and I just spam till I die, and then bring in the Val. I could actually bring in the Gren too. Like, it just, it doesn't matter. That's the Chien Pao. I, I stay in and just, it, it doesn't matter. I guess saving this technically could have been the better play, because I th probably live in Earthquake from this range from the Treads, but again, I don't, I really don't think it matters. Um, yeah. Crash. This kills, obviously. Uh, let me just make sure Scarf Chien Pao doesn't kill my guy from the pool. It doesn't. Uh, it's just... It's just the, the Val, yeah. Oh, it was, uh, oh, oh my god, the Treads was, uh, Chapel. Treads was Chapel. Um, unless he's, I outpace, unless he's Scarf. Uh, I just click Moon Blast. I mean, it, it shouldn't matter, right? Like, it, no, CC is the better play. Switch out. Uh, Treads is dead. Yeah, I can't believe I was like a Scarf for a <laughs> decent bit there. And even if they uh, lock into like Bandit Ice Shard, which uh, doesn't even kill my Val, um, I should be fine here. Ice Shard, uh, I love this. And I CC, and we win the game! Uh, GG's to Ellie. That was a that was a pretty fun game. Uh, I'm sorry about the freeze on the quillfish. Uh, that that really sucks because the quillfish stayed frozen for like five turns. Uh, that sucks. But besides that, I feel like this this was a pretty uh nice game for us. Uh, we win 3-0. Uh, again, GG's to Ellie. Ellie's link will be in the description below. Um, if I had any spice to this video, it'll be in post editing. Hopefully, I do a little bit, cut out some of the you know parts where I'm just waiting or you know whatever. Uh, yeah. Uh, we win our first Wi-Fi game. That's pretty sick. Not sure who we face next week, but whoever we face next week, uh, we'll, we'll get there when we get there. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, you guys' support means the world to me, and I'll see you next week. Bye!